Hey you guys, what's going on? Kim here. Kids outside playing on the trampoline there. Today is Sunday. We are having Sunday dinner. Today is relatively gloomy outside and it's kind of chilly out. So today for dinner, I wanted to do something in the oven. I wanted to bake. Um, so I'm making you another cheap, easy, and delicious recipe. And today is going to be a chicken parm bake. So this is everything we are going to need for today's meal. I have thin sliced chicken breast, garlic cloves, we are going to crush them, marinara sauce, I got roasted garlic, crushed red pepper flakes, you can't see that, crushed red pepper, basil leaves, parmesan cheese, mozzarella cheese, olive oil, some spaghetti noodles, and some croutons. Now this actually doesn't even really go with this, but that's just so my girls can have a side of pasta. <laughs> so this is everything you are going to need to make this chicken parm bake. All right, first things first, we are preheating our oven to 350. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get it ready. First thing you need is two tablespoons of olive oil. You're just gonna lay it in the bottom. One fourth of a teaspoon of crushed red pepper flakes. Next, you're going to shred up, chop real nice and fine however you can with a knife. I'm using this. Two cloves of garlic. Two. Next, you're gonna take your chicken. I have the thin slice, and you're just gonna lay it in the bottom. Next, you're gonna do about one jar of marinara. Oh, oven is ready. I am using roasted garlic. You can use whatever kind you like. When I open the lid, I like to give mine a shake. I'm just gonna pour it over. basil leaves right on the top of the marinara. Next, you're going to add about half of your bag of mozzarella cheese, one fourth a cup of parmesan, your entire bag of croutons. You're going to add the rest of your mozzarella cheese and one fourth of Parmesan. And this is it. <laughs> this is all you need. So this goes into the oven just like this. I'm going to break up these little balls though. I'm going to break the balls. Alright, this goes into the oven just like this for about 30 to 45 minutes. We are still cooking and it smells delicious. So right now, I am just waiting for my water to boil so I can start cooking my noodles. This chicken parm bake, you're gonna wanna bake it according to how thick your chicken is. Um, so I got thin sliced chicken, so it should only take about 45 minutes at the most, um, at the very most. But if you've got a thicker chicken, you're gonna wanna probably cook it for about an hour. So anywhere from 35 minutes to an hour. You wanna try and pull it out when the cheese and the croutons are golden brown. You don't want to overcook it, um, but you also don't want to undercook it. So just make sure your chicken is done. That's the most important thing. Um, and if you're worried that your croutons and your stuff is going to get too burnt, um, you can always start with aluminum foil on it and let it cook for the first half and then remove the aluminum foil for the last half of it. That way it doesn't burn on the top if you're cooking it for a longer period of time. But I didn't have to do that. But that's what you could do if you were worried about that. All right, our pot will be boiling soon for our noodles to go in. But our parm bake is ready. And that is what we're looking like. Ooh. And it smells so good. See how it tastes. We're gonna let it cool down while we're 
getting these going. Yeah, we're going with this cool because them bubbies, them bubbles look ferocious right now. So we're going to let this cool while we let the water start going so we can boil our noodles. Dinner is almost ready. All right, we got our water at a boil. I'm just going to take some salt, sprinkle it around in there. All right, I'm going to let that boil down. Look at that, so satisfying to watch. <laughs> and I actually am one of those people that believes the wooden spoon helps it to not boil over. <laughs> so we're gonna let these cook. All right, the noodles are ready. Get some noodles. It's cooled down enough so I can touch it. I'm going to try and get a piece of chicken. <laughs> Don't know where it is. This is going to be too much, but... Alright, let's see what you think. Oh, stop it. You like it? Let's yeah, my turn. We're going to try it out. Are you going to try it? No. No? Why Maybe. not? I'll try it. You want to try it? Yeah. Come closer. Good though. <laughs> she really likes it. She's like that. <laughs> like, yeah, that's really good. Okay. Let me try. <laughs> Still having issues? Mm. Mm -hmm. That's good. So good. It takes a long time to chew though. <laughs> <laughs> but it's delicious, right? For my small mouth. But it's delicious, right? Once again, get approved. If you can get them to eat it, it's good. All right, guys. That is going to about do it for the chicken parm bake. Teddy, you didn't try it. I want to try. Guys, as always, if you make it, let me know. Let me know how you liked it, what you did different. And as always, if you enjoyed like subscribe hey if you did it or like subscribe have a good night guys